All right, what is up? This is Slow Plays, and I'm here today with some more Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 DLC Pack 9 or Ultra Pack 1 sort of content and news. Uh, basically, this video is going to be an analysis and kind of an explanation of everything that's really going on with all these hidden DLC and things that are going to be in future raids. I'm going to try my best to break this down and explain it uh, just the best I can. And uh, I'm not guaranteeing some of this stuff just yet, just because we haven't had any news on it. But these are just my uh, predictions, I guess. And uh, just a way to get this out here for some people, because we also have a couple of new things, which I do want to shout out my homie, my boy, Tiago. Uh, once again, uh, I'll link him down below where you can check him out. Um, he's actually helped me in the past with some of the data mining and certain files that were found in the actual game that will be in future raids or uh, as future uh, mentor gifts and stuff. So there isn't a lot of stuff here, but I'm gonna try my best to explain the things um, you know, that were from the previous video whenever I broke down the actual DLC pack nine costumes and skills and everything. So as for the costumes, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys uh, one set that a lot of people don't understand about. And I didn't understand initially either, but uh, just you know, going back and looking at everything, it, makes sense now so basically this right here um you have kakunza's wig and mask and her tail so these are just separate drops okay you can't actually get these together but in the actual files if you go through and you mod everything and you know you incorporate the files onto your file there's actually this set that you can get and um initially when i showed this off i thought you know and it would make sense that this was going to be an actual drop so you could have you know just the separate mask and wig you can have the tail or you could have the full set if you want everything together like i said it would make sense right but apparently not because a lot of people were like oh how do you get this i don't know where it's at and i tried my best to respond to as many people as i could but it's just better to make this video here so basically this set is either an unused file or it's going to be in a future raid because again i didn't even like notice this when i was going through the parallel quest but if you go through and you go to the very first uh 133 ribrion's beauty lesson it shows Kakunza's wig and mask and her tail, but not a set. You can actually, like, there's no set obtainable, uh, to my knowledge, at this very moment. Now, I was thinking, okay, maybe it's like a drop with Kakunza's clothes. You know how, like, those are separate, but it just says Kakunza's clothes. It doesn't say, like, her gloves and all that stuff. So I was like, maybe that's a drop incorporated into that. But I guess not, because a lot of people are still having trouble with it. Now, I'm not guaranteeing anything just yet. I don't know if this will be a future raid or if this will be... Uh, something that they'll incorporate into the future as just something, you know, with like DLC pack of 11 or 10 or sorry, not 11, 10. <laughs> See, there's so many DLC packs I get confused, but with um, DLC 10, aka Ultra Pack 2, I have no idea what the situation on that is just yet, but uh, hopefully more news comes out and we'll be able to just like understand what's really going on but unfortunately right now at this very moment i can't tell you exactly how to get the set unless you mod the game on the pc um you know there are people that mod on ps4 but i don't condone that don't do that and if you do mod on pc uh just stay offline like me that's what i always do but um yeah that's just one thing that i was kind of confused about and um a lot of people were confused about so hopefully that makes sense too uh some other costumes here again that um i thought were already in the game like that you could unlock but you actually can't yet um, is some more equipment here and that is pretty much I think the boxer and sumo wrestling uniform so the sumo wrestling wig as well as the uh, boxer uniform and everything as well uh, with like the costume set all of that will most likely be a future raid so I'm going to assume um, maybe in the next week or two we'll probably get a raid or even like later later on uh, nothing has been confirmed with a raid just yet but it's just my like I said my assumption but um, these right here, these costume sets cannot be obtainable just yet. I want to put that out there for anybody that is still kind of looking for them. You actually can't get them just yet, which I know is unfortunate, but it is what it is. Uh, you know, we'll just have to wait until they announce the news uh, whenever the date of like raids are. Or maybe this will be like, you know, a certain gift that you can get. But you guys know how it works now, um, I guess, in the sense with, you know, how the DLC works. It, usually a DLC, then later on, within the next couple of months, there'll be a raid where you can obtain the costume costumes that were announced for this DLC. By the way, the sumo wrestling wig is just like actual goat. Like it looks amazing if you have the beard too, bro. But um, other than that, there's one last thing that I do want to showcase that has been uh, pretty much not even released yet. It will be in a future raid. 
next weekend starting on the 20th july 20th um i'll put down the dates of how long it lasts for but um it starts on the 20th on a saturday so anybody can you know hopefully most people can obtain this but i'm going to uh break this down just real quick uh so basically in the um items here if i can actually go to my bag you're gonna go to your um i guess uh items list that would probably be the best thing um, and this is just, like I said, with me having this modded file, shout outs again to Tiago for giving it to me. We have a straw hat gift. Yes, a, a little uh, unique thing. I don't know if this is a little like homage or nod to One Piece at all, but um, you're going to seek her out and actually give it to her. And I wanted to showcase that actually today and like, you know, just like I guess some gameplay of it as well. So basically, I'm going to show you guys exactly how to get this. It's going to be through a raid. Uh, like I said, do the raid on, uh, I think, the 20th, if I'm not mistaken. And then you're going to be able to purchase it from the TP Metal Shop. It's most likely going to be limited. So um, I'm going to assume that it's going to be around like i think 500 tp metals i'm going to assume that i'm not guaranteeing that but that's usually how much they are about 500 tp metals for the mentor gift so we're going to go ahead and talk with her and uh, i'm just going to say be my instructor for now just because you know you have to do that so after she becomes your you know instructor and everything you want to hand over the gift and she says hmm, you're giving this to me wow thanks hey, what do you think does this hat make does this hat look good on me? I love it. All right, so special costume has been added for customization. So we're just going to go to, uh, I guess, like a random uh, customization right here for partners. I'm gonna fly on over here. Very nice. What up, Goku? All right, so let's go ahead and talk with this guy, blah, blah, blah. And we're going to submit all of this here. Where is she? Pan's got to be somewhere. All right, so check out Pan. Change the costume. Special costume. <laughs> <laughs> that is funny. So it's actually not like really Luffy's straw hat. He's got a little bow, but it is a straw hat. Uh, kind of, kind of just like a random thing here, but uh, very cute. I like it. It's cool. Uh, go ahead and equip that, and I guess we'll go into um, a battle with her real quick, just to showcase um, <laughs> some game plan on it. But uh, like I said, it'll be on July twentieth this upcoming weekend. On Saturday, uh, I'll put the dates of how long it'll last for and everything, but after you do the raids and everything, you'll be able to go to the TP Metal Shop. It's going to be probably around 500 medals, if I'm not mistaken, and um, you'll be good to go and gold in there. So let's go ahead and go into the photo mode real quick just to showcase this. Just want to do a little bit of gameplay. It's, again, it's not like a major costume or anything. It's just a hat. You know, silly, whimsical, fun. I like it. It's cool. <laughs> and, you know, it's something that uh, is not obtainable just yet. So, uh, as you can see, you have the different costumes here. Boom. There you go. There you have it. And, unfortunately, when I do zoom in, it does that. That's one thing that's super annoying with um, playing on PC is that sometimes the zoom in, like, screws things up. But, as you can see, you can customize her with, you know, the skills and all that stuff. I guess we're fighting freaking GT trunks. I don't even care. And you know what? Shout out to the Turn of Power because I love this stage a lot. But um, other than that, if you guys have any other just like questions, concerns, or just anything at all, please comment down below. I'm trying my best to respond to them. Uh, you guys know I'm pretty good about getting to people uh, within a timely manner. So hopefully, um, you know, that helps out. But other than that, man, this is pretty cool. You know, I got the consecutive energy blast, dancing para para, blah, blah, blah. You already know it, dude. Let's, let's freaking go, Pan. What is this, man? What, what are you doing with this freaking hat? Look at that. <laughs> So that's pretty funny, bro. That really is. So let's go and hide that. Get a little photo mode action with Pan. There you go. So um, again, if you guys have any questions, let me know down below. And until then, my friends, that is going to do it. Again, big shout out to the homie Tiago for hooking me up with this, being able to showcase this for y'all today. And uh, be sure to subscribe to the channel if uh, you like this sort of content. You want to keep on seeing more. Shout out to Pan. She is ready to go like Luffy. So have a great day. Peace out. Take care. Love y'all.